Though the conditions seem dire, a C-130 fire bomber like B-134 is modified for such extreme conditions. The C-130 is an amazing aircraft. It's a robust, strong airplane that was built to haul and deliver a lot of cargo and a lot of weight. They make wonderful air tankers. C-130 air tankers are retrofitted with structural reinforcements in their fuselage to accommodate tanks that carry more than 16 tons of fire retardant. Having four big engines on a C-130 like that, it is wonderful to be able to power out of something if you find yourself in a position to be in trouble. But no aircraft is invulnerable. And for professional flight crews, safety is a priority. The 737 crew is dead right. These winds are too crazy. All right, I'm calling this one off on lower five fire control. Kum FCC, Coulson B134. Go ahead, Coulson B134. Kum FCC, conditions at Adam Enemy, too smoky and windy. There's no way to make a drop here. Copy that, Coulson B134. The Fire Control Centre in Cooma, Australia, serves as a local base for the New South Wales Rural Fire Service. It coordinates firefighting efforts in the area, both on the ground and in the air. B134, we're sending through coordinates for an alternative target, the peak view. Stand by. Your new heading is 085. Copy that, Kuma FCC, 085, proceeding to peak view. The C-130 is directed to another fire. New heading is set. All right, plan B. Here we go. 